She was an odd one, I'll give her that. But, you know, cool in a way. Maybe she was up to something, you ever think of that? I mean, she's wrapped up in this thing somehow. Well, maybe, but also things don't have to make sense. Sometimes stuff just happens, and that's the end of it. How are you doing? How are you doing? I think about as bad as everybody else right now. I feel like I've been run over with a truck. With... Uh, acid wheels, if that makes sense. Yeah, that's pretty much been the slogan of the night. We'll make shirts when we get home. Wait, have you seen this? It's like a, a star map or a diagram of planets or something. Yeah, why would she need anything like a map of the universe? I mean, it's not like she's bouncing stuff off satellites for a job. Maybe they needed to chart... Uh, signals through space or something? Uh, maybe. It's been disconnected. Bummer. Uh, put some clothes on. <laughs> Remember that guy? Where are your parents? Your kids better than. Oh, um, Chad's lake house. Yeah, yeah, that guy was a friggin' weirdo. <laughs> uh, yeah. Hey, Nona. Hey. How's it? Going. Uh, steady as she goes. Clarissa? Your Highness. For the 800th time, and I don't even know why I feel like I have to keep selling you on this, but here goes again. Michael wasn't my fault. <sighs> as long as you believe it, I guess. Find anything useful? Not yet, but you know, the night is young. So, think we're really about to make it out of here? I have my doubts, I'll be honest. Yeah, you should. But just, can we talk about something? Like, seriously, why didn't you let me go with you to Main Street? Did I do something that bad? I just don't get it. All right, Ren, honestly, the time has come to let it go. I mean, this just can't be a big deal compared to everything else tonight. Then I'm... I, 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 don't, I don't know. I'm just sore about it still, but whatever. I'll chew my resentment down till we're out. She made a lot of... What should I call these? Slides? They're, they're not videos. Um, silent memories? Huh. Ren, you were right. There's, like, a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. Never doubt me. And here's the combination for the... There's a, a padlock chest in the attic upstairs. 29, 18, 54. Uh, cool? There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Are you, um, doing okay? Yeah, I'm all right. Yeah? We're going home soon, so... Yeah, that's true.
29, 18, 54. It's a lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here, tune into the source. We think that means she couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. Is this... Ah, the boat keys. Got them. Let's blow this pop stand. Oh, I just got that popsicle stand. It does make sense. All right, we got keys for the boat. Where? I got the keys. They were in the attic upstairs. In a chest, but who cares? Let's just go. Alex. Oh, Alex. Come down here, please. We have something we want to show you. <laughs> I'm not... I'm not listening to this, all right? I'm not playing along anymore. Oh, just come down, and we'll drink to our future. <laughs> come down, okay? Ren, come on, we got a boat to catch, buddy. Nona, come on, honey, it's time to motor. Come on, Jonas. I I really need you. Don't blank out on me now. Ah, there you are. Now we imagine you're a bit confused. But don't fret. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. All training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Why are you doing this? I thought you... You guys were stuck here, or, or that this... Wasn't you signed up for this, Alexandra? Is possible. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. You walked in here with clear eyes. Sorry, okay? How many times do you want me to tell you I'm sorry? I didn't know what would happen. You have nothing to apologize for. Trust us on that. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the house, and you will go and find it. See? As simple and good humored as, as your mother's, mother's apple pie. And what if I... What if I don't, huh? What if I just stand here and don't go along with this? Refusal to cooperate will incur grim penalties, I'm afraid, but it's, it's your choice. choice. Now, let's, let's start with a softball. I spy, with my little eye, radiation. There is, of course, a time limit here. So, ten, nine, eight, Six. Oh, I'm sorry, child. You weren't even close. Stop it! Come on, no! It's, it's my fault! I, I didn't know! Look at that. The little ones up and hit the silk. If you paid attention, you'd have noticed the television set right by my side. The little X-ray emitting death machine. But right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation. In other sense. Pay attention. What does this have to do with, with us? I mean, we're... we're I not... spy with my little eye a notch. Let's make this a little harder, okay? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Uh, Alexandra, what a disappointment you've turned out to be. Don't, just, just stop, please. Don't do anything. Oh, your new brother. Gone to first light. This isn't their fault. Bring them back. They'll come back when you learn their purpose, child. It's time for the bonus round, Alex, so stay quick. This is what you really want to find. I spy with my little eye a picture of a memory. Be fast now. The, the picture of, of... I guess it's Maggie, Adler, and somebody. Is this it? Yes, very nice. That's Margaret Adler and her friend Emma. See, you and your schoolyard chums are experiencing... Well, this has sort of happened before. Maggie and Emma tried to sport with us many years ago, and, well, only one survived. But in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time. 
and a far-reaching tolerance for the ignorance. Wait, what? What happened to Anna? Let's leave it at the poor girl didn't know what she was playing with. It doesn't matter. They're not an eternal recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we will use the waves to absorb into your friends so the sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. Wait, what? What happens to them after you're... absorbed? Their form will exist with us inside. It will be a swap, you see, of... essences, I guess you could call them. We tried it too quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. We had to keep you here, on the island. And it will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. And on to the next. There has to be another way. I mean, just maybe, I mean, maybe I can do something with the radio. We never had our time. It was ripped from us. We watched the universe's conception fly to its demise over and over and over again. You don't know what it's been like, but how could you? What you're doing is wrong, and you know that. Any integrity we once had drowned in the reef ages ago. When our vessel dashed on the rocks, we had until dawn. And so will you. We would spend our time wisely. And we thank you for your good service. <sighs> so, I'm kind of screwed. He should go out on his own. Okay, seriously, who are you? So we can go on. <laughs> I think I'm gonna be sick. Me first. Uh, it wasn't a dream or a vision or something. You and Clarissa standing in the living room just now, was it? Ugh. No, that was very, very real. Oh, and by the way, next time, put some actual effort into the game, pretty please. It felt like someone was shoving spiders down my throat. Yeah. It was much harder than it looked, trust me. So, I mean, Christ. If Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then... I mean, the plan has to be to retrieve her, right? I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A ghost is... Clarissa is only, like, one slice of the problem. We're all infected or whatever, so we need to rip the issue off like a bandage all at once. Okay, great, yeah. But how do we do that? Well, uh... Good question. Maggie? Ah, I think Maggie Adler might have had some sort of a plan or a, a scheme or something to fix what's going on. What possible plan could Maggie Adler have? First of all, she's dead. And second of all, she was like the island mother- She left secret notes all over the place. The ghosts hate her. She was involved with it somehow. Come on. And she thought she needed to tune a radio into the, the source of the problem in the cave. Oh, forget it. What's the point? We can't use it anyway. Well... If we're going to the cave... Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right, I know there are a whole bunch of secret communist bomb-fearing tunnels dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. What kind of name is a Fippany Fields anyway? Wait, is it a Fippany? It's Epiphany Field. Oh, that makes more sense. <laughs>